Welcome back to today's morning report on Thursday, the 28th of January with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Antip Markets. Let's look at dollar yen now. We've had this sort of consolidation in the past few days on dollar yen, slightly positive bias to it as well. And you're looking at the momentum indicators, you're still sort of backing a recovery, really, aren't you? You had the RSI breaking that downturn, you've got crossover positive on the MACD and you've got the stochastics as well which continue to rise so we're now put, putting pressure and it would seem uh, to the upside and um, it seems as though this sort of building for an upside breakout doesn't it the old um, that old high or that high at uh, 1887 is breaking on the intraday basis we saw 1905 yesterday and uh, it seems, still seems to be you're getting more positive sort of moves on these candles and uh, that seems to be as though we're getting this upside pressure. I talked yesterday about a bull flag pattern. Um, we've seen seen this sort of consolidation, which you've sort of broken out above. Interestingly enough, you've actually got support on the on the uh, underside of that um, sort of downtrend. There, you've got going on. So it seems to be as though that you're sort of now building for more upside pressure. You've seen a, a sequence of high lows in the past couple of days as well. Momentum indicators mm, broadly positive. On the RS, uh, on the RSI, MACD, and stochastics, and it just seems as though we're seeing upside pressure above that 1875 level. We're sort of moving consistently in a in a higher low basis, and um, pressure is building to the upside. Now, if you see a move clear of 119, which was yesterday's high, certainly a close above that, you then sort of continue this retracement back um, into the uh, into the re overhead resistance band. Next resistance comes in around 120 figure, which were these lows from late uh, late December. It's resistance of these lows here from late December, and uh, that would be your next sort of target level. But you do have the prospect, as I said, of that being a bit of a sort of bull wedge or um, bullish falling wedge or sort of bullish flag pattern uh, which continues the recovery so it certainly seems as though that um, with the improvement in risk appetite Dolian is picking up now and um, it seems to be that uh, the bulls are starting to build trying to push higher and uh, pulling on the uh, uh, pulling higher gains now in terms of the support you've got 118 figure as the reaction low from yesterday that needs to stay intact I would say because then you're still above all the moving averages and then obviously you'd confirm as a, a bear retrace uh, as a bear continuation lower on a move below 11763 so I wish you good luck in your trading today and I will speak to you later thank you